Hello everybody, McGregor here, and today I'm gonna to show you how to use the ant in Planet Side 2, and I'm gonna show you actually how to build a base. Uh, bases, if you guys don't know, are a great way to actually support your team, especially with orbital strikes. You can build like a little orbital strike thingy, and yeah. But uh, I unfortunately don't have access to that. <laughs> Not yet, anyways. So to actually get the ant, if you guys don't know, if you're new to the game, uh, you actually have to access the ground vehicle terminal and you'll just find it there. Now yours might look like this with the default little mini laser, but uh, I highly suggest upgrading a weapon right away. Either an AA gun or I'm using the Basilisk uh, just to do a little ping damage and whatnot. Um, also, if you guys don't know, there are some passive certs for the ant. So you can have more storage and also larger radar. So, and I'm also using stealth, uh, scout radar so I can find stuff and stealth and also racer high speed chassis. So it's here. Who is it? Friendly? I thought I heard somebody go by. <laughs> but yeah, let's take out the ant. And just like any other vehicle, now we have to find some of that resources. Now I gotta watch out because there are TR in the area. So let me just zoom out here. And unfortunately, base building is only as as far as I know right now in the PC version of Planet Side 2. Alright, now if you look on the minimap right now, you see that little symbol? that I'm coming up towards. That's the resource we actually have to collect uh, in our little ant here. So we're actually close to the warp gate. And as you can see, mine can hold 9,000 and this little note here can actually has 6,000. Sometimes a lot of them little, little ones, you can get uh, 2,000 in them. I've seen some with like 36,000, so. But let us just mine this. You just use it like any other weapon. I'm holding down the left mouse button. And then there we go. Looks like we got another one here. Let us fill her up. Now, the one, one thing I like about uh, doing all this is if I'm like in the mood to play but I don't really want to do any type of combat, but I still want to gain uh, certs and all that. I find doing this is a great way to actually um, get certs and experience and all that. You pop back up. Good for you. So let us try to find a good spot to build a base. Now, I don't know if you guys can tell, but there are red circles around actual bases where I'm not allowed building. Can I build here? No, I cannot. Too close to that. So let me find a good spot. All right, so I'm just gonna build our little base here, just really for demonstration purposes. So the first thing we need to do is deploy our ant. And to do that, you press B as in Bob on the keyboard. And there we go, we, we deploy. So we gotta get out and come to the back. E to access your terminal, and then we want this silo here. So we need at least 2,000 resources, and then we can place this. To place it, now, as you can see here, it's too high. And then once it's green, you can actually place, and if it's too low, yeah, it turns red again. So to actually place it, you need to hit E on the keyboard. If you want to rotate it, it's with the left but mouse button or the right mouse button. So let's just place you here. So I hit E on the keyboard. And there we go. Come back in here, hit B to undeploy. And I gotta face the silo. And then left mouse button is to put your resources in the silo itself. So I'm gonna do that. And once you actually built the silo, you can actually access the silos terminal to actually build um, a whole bunch of stuff around around your base. So let's see here. 
here. Gotta wait a little bit. There we go. And then now I can just do stuff like anti-personnel turret. Oh, and I'm under attack. Oh, I'm in a, I'm really close to uh, other bases. Place you right there. All right, and while that's building up, let's build a wall. Let's keep this topped up. Like I said, TR's in the area, so... And I also have this turret module. Place that down. And there we go. That's basically how you build a base. Um, as you can see here, there's a lot of different modules and stuff like that. I like oh, uh, I like unlocking them with certifications instead of using the actual money. Once you unlock them with the certifications, then you can actually use the um, actual resource to to build them instead, like like this here. So, uh, before I let you guys know, I forgot to mention a couple of uh, things. Uh, one thing is, uh, do remember that you cannot place certain things close to other things. Like, like as you see here, I have, uh, another tower and I can't place it close to these towers and they're actually highlighted. So, but if I go far enough out of that circle, I can do it. This circle here is actually this, uh, AI module. So let me just place this here and there we go. The last thing I forgot to mention was how to actually remove uh, one of your buildings that you no longer want. And to do that, what you need is the actual multi-tool. Now the multi-tool can be found under field tools here, either on the ant or on the actual silo itself. Like you see here. And yeah, you just unlock it and there you go. Now the description says that you can repair constructions with it. Um, and also you can despawn it. So to despawn something, all what you have to do is right click on it. If I come in over here, and just hold down uh, the right click. Let me just find a spot. Oh, there we go. Terminal, and there it goes. It's gone. I don't know if the resources go back into your silo or not. I don't think it really matters because it's, it's, it's like worth nothing, so. <laughs> Yeah, that is it. If you guys have enjoyed this little quick tutorial, please uh, leave a like button uh, down below. And also, just so you guys know, I do stream every Wednesdays, Saturdays, and Sundays, either on Twitch or here on YouTube. Um, sometimes I do live stream Planet Side too. So yeah, if you guys have any questions or anything like that, please let me know. But yeah, once again, thanks for watching, and I'll see you all next time. Bye bye.